How do you know when God is moving in your life? Coming up next on Pastor Bob's Coffee Break. Good morning, Lord. What are you up to today? I want to be part of it. One of our older mugs. Great way to wake up, isn't it? Lord, tell me what you're doing. I'd like to be part of it. And that's what we're talking about today. How do you know when God is moving? How do you know? And here's our question for today. Dear Pastor Bob, how do you know when God is moving in your life? How can you be sure that it's him? Great question. You know, it's a good idea to move when God says move. To do what God is asking you to do and to go where he's asking you to go. But how do you know exactly what that is? Well, we have Moses leading his people through the desert and for many, many decades, they went around in circles, in circles, basically, wandering through the desert, following the cloud, eating manna from heaven, all of that, and around and round and round they went. And I wonder why sometimes God leads us in circles in the same way. We feel like, okay, we should be out of this process and we're still in it. And God says, you're not ready yet. You know, he, he had some work to do with Moses and his people, but he has some work to do with us too. And uh, the reason that it spent so m they spent so many years going to the promised land was that they weren't ready yet. Moses wasn't ready yet. And God was perfecting in them some things and getting some some things out of them that needed to happen. And it took that long to do it. I love this mug because this is the principle right here. Having a willing heart and saying, Lord, I want you to do it. Good morning, Lord. What are you up to today? I'd like to be part of it. I want to be part of what you're doing. And you know, sometimes we simply go around in circles until we're ready. You know, folks, some of you right now are going around in a lot of circles. And some of those circles are because God is simply preparing you for the next thing. And you may be tired of your circles. You may be tired of saying, Lord, I'm, it feels like I've been in this spot for so long. Lord, I'm ready to dream new dreams and do new things. And the doors don't open. What's going on here? I'm going around in circles. Not always a bad thing. God says, I'm preparing you. I'm getting you ready. I am focused on your well-being and where you're going. And I want you to be ready to be there when we get there. Yeah. So he uses our circle time to, to teach us, to prepare us, to get us to the place where we need to be. Folks, God is faithful. He is absolutely faithful. And if you feel like in your life that things are taking too long or things aren't going as quickly as you want them to go, it's not a problem. Look a little deeper saying, Lord, what are you perfecting in me that I need to work on? Lord, what are we doing in this circle time that's getting me ready for what's ahead? Lord, what do I need to prepare my heart for as we proceed? Lord, what are you doing today? Because I really want to be part of it. Well, folks, don't forget, you are blessed. 
So go and be a blessing.